Hi, I'm Kimberly Schneiderman, Senior Practice Development Manager at Rise Smart, here with your weekly tip. If you want to reap health benefits from your physical fitness workouts, you need to follow a few basic practices. These include pushing yourself, challenging your endurance, stretching your muscles, taking adequate time to rest, and always starting with those big, deep breaths. The same practices can be applied to your career transition activities. How, you ask? Let's talk about it. First, push yourself. Try new activities, especially when it comes to building your professional network, will often require you to push yourself. Networking events and professional get-togethers may be unfamiliar to you or seem a little awkward at first. Pushing yourself to reach out to just one more person, to set up just one more phone call, or to meet for coffee with a potential referral partner can have long-term positive effects on your career transition. Next, practice endurance. Just like in working out, it can sometimes be tough to keep going at a strong pace. By sticking with your program, even when the going gets tough and following the prescribed activities, you will find that the reward on the other side is significant. Just like in physical fitness, career transition can be challenging. Practicing endurance when you feel like quitting will help you get over those performance humps. Next, stretch your muscles. In physical fitness, you stretch to help avoid stiff and sore muscles. To avoid stiffness in your career transition, stretch your muscles to try new approaches to long-standing actions. Revise your professional value proposition now and again to ensure it's on point with your desired message. Work on your smart stories as they relate to requirements of the positions you are pursuing. And reach out to new people to keep your networking muscles stretched. Next, take adequate time to rest. While you shouldn't use rest time as an excuse to quit working on your transition when things get difficult, you definitely do need to take time off a few hours or more at various points to help you reflect on your hard work and re-energize yourself so you can be strong in your overall transition efforts. And finally, start with big deep breaths. If you've ever taken an exercise class, you've likely been instructed to st start by taking big deep breaths, and for good reason. Taking these deep breaths has shown to increase energy, promote blood flow, calm anxiety, and relieve stress. Take a few deep breaths as you start your day to give yourself the energy you need, or whenever you need a short pause to rejuvenate and calm those job search jitters. As you progress in your career transition, you will find that some days you feel strong and determined, and other days you find it tough to get going. And that's typical, just like with the physical fitness routine. The key is to keep your eye on the prize. No one can do the work for you, so be sure to review your goals whenever you feel like you're getting off track. Thank you for joining me today, and for more ideas in your job search, be sure to tune in to this week's webinars.